Please, Rowan, calm down. You don't need to serve everyone that's around. Rowan, relax. You're going... You're very busy right now. I can tell you're extremely busy. I can steal from your till. We make a clap. We make a clap. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to Heal Please Heal Gaming. Thanks so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. We are playing today a nice kind of relaxing game called Staxel. Now, Staxel is one of these games that's identified as Stardew Valley, Harvest Moon, and Minecraft combined into one where you can build your own buildings you have a farm you have to attend to crops so on and so on and there's a little town that you can pretty much assist i hope you guys have been keeping well thank you so much for tuning in and let's go jump into saxel and see what this is all about game came out i think around last week so you guys can find the link down below if you guys want to find it on steam and check it out for yourself but we're going to start saxel i don't know how far i'm going to get into this but we're going to get start saxel so maybe a little small little series because uh i like farming games not gonna lie all right, so this is where we can start developing our avatar. This is a creepy ass avatar. Uh, we're gonna be males this time. Wait a minute. What's the diff? Oh my god! When you're male, your waist goes out. When you're female, your waist goes in. Oh my! All right, so this is us. We are the very cool, down-to-earth farmer with the hair kind of put in front of our eye to tell people that we are down with it, but we're not down with you. All right, so we are in Staxel. Like I said, guys, very similar to how Minecraft is, where you can actually kind of break apart these uh, stones or build your own. Doors auto-open, which is fantastic. There is a computer. What have you been looking at on this computer? Oh, my lord. I don't even want to know. You're a new face. We don't get many of those around here. You must be heal, please heal. I am. Uh, on behalf of all of us here in Staxel, welcome. I'm Farm Fan, by the way. Um, Maximilian. Did you just walk in? Oh my god. I've been set to make sure you know how to take care of the farm properly. That was that was you, right? The one taking over the old farm? Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Uh, no, no, it's not. So that's what I'm saying. Stardew Valley, you took over your grandfather's farm. You're taking over the old farm here. Excellent, just as I thought. So are you ready to learn a bit about farming? Maximilian, what the fuck, dude? I can show you around the village and evaluate your skills. We need to make sure you know what you're doing. Then we can give you a farming license. Sound good? Uh, sure? Glad to hear it. First, I'll take you for a brief tour of the village. Then we'll head over to the farm. Hopefully, it'll quickly start to s feel familiar. Oh, and if you manage to get lost, you can check your map anytime. Follow me. <laughs> the one thing I will say about the game that I do like is the fact that I can move around quickly. Like, I, there's no running mechanism. This is pretty much you're just always running, which I kind of like, to be honest. This place is looking horrible. Can you pull some flowers? We don't deal with flowers in my, con my town, all right? We want nothing but clear grass, and that's about it. Where the hell did you go? This is the local tavern. This is where you can come and get yourself piss-ass drunk and flirt with people. Now, it's a pretty nice place to hang out after a long day at work. Rowan, the owner, can be a good source of local rumors. You should head in and talk to him. I think he has something for you. I'll be waiting right here. Okay. Rowan! Rowan, where are you, my man? Hello, Rowan. Oh, you look so fantastic. That beard is amazing. Oh, I didn't think I've seen you around here before. New in town, eh? I'm sure you'll fit right in. Here, this is this is on the house. A mug of sap. Think of it as a welcome to the town. I hope you see you around here every now and again. By the way, and perhaps this might seem like a long question, but is there a particular type of animal you like? Um, dogs are okay. I'm more of a cat person, to be honest with you, because frankly, cats should learn... Cats can just take care of themselves. Uh, oh, how lucky for you. A merchant came by this other day whose aunt's friend's sister's son had a, had a litter. Aunt's friend's sister's son, Jesus Christ. If you come back once you're done with Farm Fan, I might just have one for you. Good luck. Thank you for getting me my cat. Uh, if you're going to grab my pussy, though, can you do me a favor? Can you make it nice and soft? Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thank you, Rowan. You're, 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 a, you're a melch, Rowan. You're a melch. The hell's a melch? <laughs> Now that I think about it, I haven't properly introduced myself. I'm the mayor of this little town. Oh, are you? I Well, with the name of Maximilian, I can definitely see it. I imagine I'll be seeing you quite often. No flowers in my garden. Uh, oh, this is my. This is not my garden. The supermarket sells many of your items you need on a daily basis. There's things like pet food, tools, and other handy items. While you were busy chatting with Rowan, I popped over to the merchants. They're just one on the other side of the town square. They don't sell wares. They'll buy things off you, too. You just need to place an item on the sell spot and click it. Okay. Beetroot seed, thank you. These seeds should come in handy, I think. You will need to head to the farm so that you can actually make use of them. This might be a good time to memorize the path to the... 
farm from the village. This way, I can't see this guy. Leaf. Oh God, I don't want to talk to you. You're scary. Hi, Oscar. Hi, Kyle. We have what we have here. Another troublemaker. Oscar is the name. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Oh, and stay off the grass. Keep the mug or the mud on the farm. Hey, Oscar. I'm gonna pull out your fucking shit. You like that, huh? You like this? You like me doing this? I pulled out your. You motherfucker. So when I played the other game, because I just did a test game to try it out, the farm actually was different. So I'm assuming that it's, it, the world is procedurally generated, so it's always going to be different. It's kind of cool, actually. So here it is, your new home. It might be a bit daunting at first, but you'll settle in. You're a little ways outside the village compared to the rest of us. Hopefully your pet show should keep you in feeling too lonely once it arrives. If not, we're just down the road and always happy to chat. Perhaps we should start by heading out to the fields. All right, thank you. This is my house. This is my house. You can hoe grass and create tilled soil to plant seeds. If you hold down the button, you can charge it to tell a larger area. Give it a shot and plant the seeds I gave you earlier. If you lost them, you can buy some new more from the ones of the merchant. All right. Uh, how do I? Okay, this is how I get it. Uh, till. Hold on, we gotta till with this. Oh, let's charge it up. Let's make a larger area. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. One? You got me one seed? That's what you got me is one forsaken seed? This she shakes her head yes. Good job. Here's a little something to celebrate your success. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna move the camera because I see I just know I'm just noticing I'm gonna block the inventory. Uh, you can use a watering can to water your crops. If you don't water them every day, you'll start to wither. Withering crops won't grow. Go on, give it a shot. All right, there we go. Sorry, guys. Now you can see the actual, uh... There we go. Seeds are growing. I've watered it. Should I water it again? Can I water you? Looks like you've got the hang of it. Yeah, uh, here, another reward. 200 petals. Is that your currency's petals? And it's going to take quite a while for the crop to grow. In fact, I'm already starting to feel a bit thirsty. Could you take this note to Rowan and bring me back something to drink? What am I, your goddamn servant now? Might be good to see if he has an, any task for you while you're at it. I'll be waiting right here when you get back. Hey, Rowan. That farm bitch wants something to drink, apparently. Good day, heal please heal. Is that a note for me? Huh, so farm fan sent you to fetch me some... What type of name is farm fan? Saying to fetch you some sap, eh? Huh? So he drinks far too much of that stuff. Hmm. She's probably a drunker. Tell you what, run a little errand for me and I'll see what I can do. Nothing major or anything. Really? Just hand this over to Leaf at the general store and he'll know what, what I need. Oh, is that that weird elf dude with the green hair? It's an order I've been waiting for in just under a week. As you can probably see, I've been too busy to leave the place unattended. Yeah. This is very busy. Please, Rowan, calm down. You don't need to serve everyone that's around- Rowan, relax. You're going- You're very busy right now. I can tell you're extremely busy. I can steal from your till. Oh, that's tempting. <laughs> you look weird, Leaf. Hey, buddy. Hi there. I run the local store. Their name's Leaf. Do stop by. Ah, so Rowan has finally sent order to pick up this order. Certainly took him long enough. He's not even that far. He's across town. Come on. Whatever it is, I'm starting to smell a bit funny. I'll be happy to see it go. Oh, that's nice. By the way, congratulations on the new pet. Must be nice to have such a good companion. It can get pretty lonely out there. You look a bit confused. Well, never mind. I have something for you, too. Uh, food bowl, pet food. This will definitely come in handy now that you have a pet. All right, thank you. Uh, we sell a lot of useful stuff here in the store. Feel free to browse the shelves and buy whatever you need anytime. But for now, you be get... You better get that parcel out of here. I'm not sure how much longer I can stand it. Well, you know what? How about I actually just steal a couple of stuff? Look at this. I can buy pawn stuff. Look at this. Balloons. A desk clock. Inkwell. What else is there? There's... Oh, here's the tree. Here's the seeds. Uh, cucumber seeds. There's tree seeds. Oh, lordy. What is this? Peach recipe. Jam recipe. I can make recipes. There's breads and everything around here. Is this... Oh, look, there's a kitchen... A miniature kitchen sink, a miniature bookshelf, all of these stuff here I, I, I'll just use and build my own little custom house. Small little custom house. What is this? A center for ants! Hey, Rowan. Rowan, Rowan. Rowan, you're way too busy, man. You gotta calm down, okay? Listen, I got your parcel, okay? Uh, here. You need to calm down. Can you actually- Do you have time to see me? Ah, it's overpowering aroma. You have my parcel. I can express how much I have been looking forward to this. The entrancing fragrance, the incomparable flavors. Hmm, you know, 
You want to know what's in the package? It's a special type of fermented fish. That's disgusting. There's only a few islands out there that produce it, so it's pretty hard to come by. That's disgusting. I take it the, to tea. I like to tease Leaf a little by having it sent to the store first, but enough about that. I imagine you're eager to get back to your pet. Huh. Oh, I didn't tell you. I've already sent your pet over to the farm fan. That there is just a letter with some advice for farm fan. Make sure you give it to her for me. Don't worry about the sap she sent for you. I've already dealt with that. You should hurry on back and meet your new companion. Remember, you're welcome here anytime. It usually gets a bit livelier in the evening, so that might be a nice time to stop by. No, no, it's not. Dude, you're so busy right now. You probably shouldn't stay out too late, though. It's good to get back to your bed and sleep a night away. Dude, you're too busy. You need to relax, okay? Calm down. Hmm, so where's my sap, motherfucker? You don't have it? Rowan assured you that this is all you needed? Oh, by the way, is, is that letter for me? Let me just take it off you. You just grabbed the letter off me. I didn't even hand it to you. Well, now, he didn't have to be so blunt about it. I didn't read the letter, so I don't know what he said. Probably he's like, you're too drunk. You're a drunkard. You can't stop stop drinking. Oh, well, nothing for it, I guess. You're lucky I'm a kind-hearted person or I might have with, withheld your pet in retaliation. Why, why are you holding my pet? Give me my pet. There you go. She gave me a hammer, did she not? Look at this. I do have a hammer. I'm going to break that stone. I'm going to break this weed. I'm going to break this weed. I'm going to break... Oh, my. Uh... Oh, hold on. I, I just broke a piece of my house, lady. How, uh... Okay, look, okay, good. <laughs> I was gonna say, look, I just broke a piece of my house. How do I how do I deal with this, lady? Alright, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the little house there. Oh, look at the little kitty! It's orange! Hi, kitty! I don't want your name to be Chloe, though. That's a bad name. No, it's not a bad name, but still, I don't feel a name like that for Chloe for a cat. You want some food, Chloe? Look, there's some food. Yep. Yeah. Chloe, can you relax a little bit? Oh, we can rename it, okay. What shall we name this cat? Ah, oh, I know. Satan. There we go. Hi, Satan. How are you? <laughs> Great, now your pet should be good for a while. Hmm. You know what? I'm tired of waiting on that crop. Lady, you're really, uh, you're really a needy person, aren't you? Okay, look, I got my goddamn forsa forsaken crop. I got a beat, okay? You did it! Not as hard as it sounds, is it? The time has finally come to give you your farm registration letter. Yeah, you should head to the town hall and fill it with Max as soon as possible. In exchange, you'll get a special package to help jumpstart your farm. As for me, I think it's about time I get out of your way. You can always look me up in town. Good luck. Oh, it's trash job. Son of a bitch. All right. Uh, you need hammer, broom. Okay, now hold on. I have a hammer. There we go. I have hammer to bash these spider webs. No spider webs in my house, okay? I'm not a spider web type of person. I will not appreciate spider webs here. Uh, I don't want to break my window. Though, is it my window? Is my window dirty or something? I can't even tell. Oh my god. The, the walls are like broken in here. Oh my god, look at the washrooms there. Hell, you know what? If I wanted to, I could just bust open that and just have a full master bedroom with an ensuite bathroom where it's not even covered. So when somebody comes over, I can literally shit and they're like watching me do it. Thank you.